All right, I never make videos on Sundays, but goddamn, sometimes something comes out and you just gotta, you just gotta talk about it. Like this new forum post from 11th Hour Games about new affixes and unique items coming. <sighs> let's just, let's just start. Look at these boots. Requires level 85, so top end gear. You're almost done with your crit, like dealing with enemy crits just by having this base of boots. And then the 185 arm. Look at the 50% haste effect. Nasty. Bro, we don't need more CDR in the game. There's already, there was already too much and now there's too, too much. It's just a lot. That's gonna, it's gonna break some builds. This is nice. It's, I mean, it's nice. I mean, before the, the early, the earliest mana support gloves were like fucking level 12. Now they're, now there's an end game one. Like it's not cool. Oh my. <laughs> Thank God these are level 80. Adding so much ward to carry threshold because warlock. Oh, 70 up to 74 at 31. Oh. Oh. My. Been, uh, your sister. Your sister. Oh my god. Oh my god. A hail of arrows. Mana scaling hail, hail of arrows. Oh my god. Oh Jesus Christ. G up to 17. Ward gain on kill. How is it 173? Ward decay threshold, bro. That's just from one item. Stun avoidance. A hundred. 30! 513 armor on this. That amount of stun avoidance on Void Knight is like... That's a, that alone makes you almost guaranteed. At a high roll of that, you're almost never going to get stunned anymore. Move speed up to 16 flat. Are you fucking kidding me? So they nerf so they nerfed the health regen from Vitality and then they just put it on okay. This was the literally Primalist was the only class that actually made health regen like stupidly overpowered. Okay. And acolyte a little bit, but still. Cast speed, mana regen. Yeah, that's yeah, I mean that's great. You don't that that's like for leveling. Oh, that's 41? What I was like, oh, as an end game, this is like whatever, but like it's mid-game. It's mid game. Thank God that was it. That's all we have to worry about. Oh my. Dude. Is that a hybrid affix? Those are hybrid. They can come in any combination. So it could be spell melee, could be bow melee, it could be bow spell. You used to only be able to get this on uniques or amulets. But it wasn't even it wasn't even minion penetration. This is hybrid, so you can do it yourself. For each of the seven damage types. This this breaks minions. This actually just minions are done. Min minions are too strong now. Like that's imbalanced. That's imbalanced. Oh, great. New affixes. Let's see. Are you fucking kidding me? That was literally like the all Aura of Decay needed was one thing. And then they put it on the two by two. 
any frequency modifiers, just a more damage multiplier with diminishing returns. Like when you directly cast chaos bolts, that's fine. That's fine. It's not. It's, wait, unless they can, can they shotgun? Bro, this, I don't, oh, they can shotgun. Okay. Okay, here's some, okay. Here's some rogue stuff. Throwing damage with cow traps flat. Okay, that's fine. Area and shred armor with cow traps. That's pretty insane to have that. Both of them on the same? I don't know. Bro, th that's the two by two. That's the two by two. Get 11% chance for double damage on Falcon Strikes. Nah. Oh. Damage and area with die bot. It already looked too good. And now they're just giving it all this area for free. Oh, explosive trap. Yeah. Explosive trap on chest piece. Is that. How good is that? I don't know about that one. Increased frequency of expending storm. Frequency, bro. Gathering storm. Getting that increased area for all like storm skills like tornado, maelstrom, avalanche. Fuck. Gain a storm stack when you use gathering storm and hitting it. It just makes it faster. It just more it, quality of life. That's nasty. Oh, new uniques. Let's see this. Okay. Oh. Three to shield throw. Okay. Retali. Oh. Oh. <sighs> Unblock. That's 30, oh, that's 33% from what we see here. This is probably, that has to be close to a max roll like that. Can, it gives you flat reflected, throwing damage for a shield throw per 10 damage reflected to attackers. Oh, oh, what the f <laughs> I was literally, <laughs> I was literally trying to make this build level 35. What are they doing? What the fuck, man? <sighs> All right. Let's see this. Okay. Man is spent, gained his ward. 51% armor. Potion slot per weaver's item. More damage to stun. It's all right. Oh, the flat. It's a plated belt. Level 19. Let's look at these. Falcon fists per level of falconry. The skill. It gives plus four to falconry. It gives plus three to... But then you get 24 with this roll. 24 times 13 is 240 and 72. So 312. Flat? Well, unarmed? 312 flat and then the area you're getting like you're getting nearly double area for, um oh, oh and then it stacks that doesn't have a stack limit so you just keep oh <laughs> what is oh my god this is one of the coolest this is one of the coolest it's on plated glow Why does it say level 27 right there? What is this? Dude, what is this? That's not level 27, dude. That's a tier. That's a tier X unique. Like, they have a thing. They can't keep getting away with it. Okay, three to fire, three to damage over time, two to acolyte, guarantee you the Chthonic 
fissure you can turn into a fire. Oh, applies to flim. Okay, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh, you cast the, oh, you cast the thing and then the thing? Okay, yeah. I threw up a little bit in my mouth. Okay, okay, let's check this out. Flask damage converted to cold. Poison chance from all sources converted to frostbite chance for acid flask. Cool, yeah, that's cool. Offhand catalyst, oh, for acid flask? That's a cool idea. Chance to apply, okay, for cold, okay. That's sick. Wait. Wait, but. That's just, oh my God, that's so cool. It's a level zero. Holy shit. Bro, like a caster rogue now? What is going on here? They can't keep getting away with it. Literally, the game's completely different. Every single thing they fucking do, man. Game is completely different. Dude, these boots, these are such, like, the first everything up until the uniques, I was like, cool. Like, amazing, obviously. And then they, like, showed off the uniques. The fact that this is a leveling, like, if you drop this, leveling's easy. Leveling's done. You never have to worry about anything anymore. Okay? And the fact that if you do, like, bro, they added, oh my god. Fucking God, dude. This is one of the coolest uniques ever seen. Like how? Bro, the Crypt Multi Pretend Uncapped Necro. My guy, you're gonna be having like four, you're gonna have like 400% Necro. What the fuck? I cannot believe this. I can't believe this. I. The patch notes tomorrow about to be crazy.